Welcome to I Love Stocks, and today I want to discuss Tesla. Tesla had a real good day yesterday on a uh, little bounce from Kathy Woods. And you know how I am about Tesla. I just love this company. I've been trading it for over 10 years, and I think I've only done bad on it three times in that period. And right now I'm in an overnight swing that's down a little bit. But I'm going to go ahead and talk about a little bit about Kathy Woods. She came out yesterday and kind of just mentioned again that she's still strong. And it's one of her biggest, it, it is her biggest holdings in her account. And that is in ARK, A-R-K-K. You can find it on, on NASDAQ. And Tesla is her number one holdings and she's still confident in trade. And I've been confident in the trade probably before she even was, but who knows. I've been watching it for over 10 years, and 20, we started having the good breakout in the EV car sector in 2020, and then 2021. And I think we're still going to be bullish in this sector now that everybody's piled on. Everybody says they're going to change their fleets, and from General Motors to, I mean, just goes on and on and on. And usually when you have a bunch of rollouts, you're going to have big mergers, and we're seeing that also right now. And CCIV is a good example with uh, Lucid. I think it's going to come out and really boost that one. And you got Nile. And you just got so many different good companies to watch right now that are on a pullback. And I think it'll last probably the rest of this week and then go on. But I'm still bullish on Tesla, and I scalped it three times yesterday. Or I scalped it twice. And I'll show you my, my entries here. I got in here on the double top, sold it out up here at the bounce, got an exit, and then I got back in it. This is, uh, and then I got, again, I exited at resistance level, my target of 777, and that was right down here. Then my second exit was up here at 785. And then Kathy Woods came out and started hyping up the stock, and I think that was right down in here. I just, it pulled back a little bit, and I just kind of, Took a little break from it. I was expecting it to pull back a little bit more than get into the trade. But I missed it. It just started running. People started catching attention. The news hit the fan. And then I found this flag, this bullish flag that was came out. Oh, wrong thing. Well, I had it up here. Where's that? It's gone now. Now oh, there it is. This little bullish flag came into scene. And when you see something like this on a spike on a flagpole, you can usually give it a little bit of time. And I got down here, right down here at the bottom. And I said, I'm ready to get in this and get ready into the next spike. So that's what happened. I got into the trade right here on this bottom right here. I'm pretty confident in the trade at this time because it fell back to my support level that I had drawn. And I said, I'm ready for it. So she went ahead and bounced up, hit my previous resistance at 797, and then went ahead and took off after hours. So it's down now. We're down here at 782.51. You're still going to have a lot of bears fighting this stock, but I think here during the day we're going to have a rebound, and it's going to ahead and move on up, I hope in a way. If not, I might add on to my position. This is going into next week. I took the trade down here at first at 475. That was yesterday at $800 strike and sold it at 571. Pulled back again. This was after her announcement, so I jumped back into the trade again. Scalped it up to 670. Took my profit, and then I got back in it up here for the uh, February 26th, 850 strike at 870. So this thing's going to be down this morning probably when I first come in. And I might add a position to that and just go ahead and hold on to it into next week. And that's going to be Tesla. That's, and, you know, change trading plans change with me. It, I could just go ahead and say I'm going to get out with profit. But I don't think I'll take a loss on it because I'm pretty bullish on the stock. Subscribe, if you like, to our Twitter link. Miss Vegas is posting alerts in here. She's the money flow queen. Also on our website, we do have our links to our stock twits accounts. You could hit them, pull this up. I made it to 3,200 yesterday. I want to try to double that by the end of the year if I can. And we do have a, 
also on the website. We have our little YouTube channel right here. You can go back, follow some of the YouTube, some of the channel, YouTubes that we've done. Please subscribe, ring that bell for future updates, and hit that like button if you like this video. And everybody have a great day. Always remember, I love stocks.